Hello, welcome back. There's a few things I need to do before I end the turn and continue our path to uh, tourism victory. Uh, there's a great artist here, which I've been meaning to uh, create a golden age for a while. I could create a great work of art, but I still think it's probably more well worthwhile to start a golden age at this point. Uh, some of the culture it produces will be turned into uh, tourism anyway. Uh, because I have uh, hotels in my cities. Right, so Golden Age has started. I also want to buy a cargo ship. So I've got a, now got a spare trade route going. I'm going to send that to Colombo. Uh, because they want a trade route and their influence is getting low. Uh, there's also another key thing I uh, need to do. Right, I'm gonna, I think I'm going to surprise you here. Right, so purchase... Settler. And you might ask, why the hell am I buying a settler at this stage of the game? Right, something which I hadn't realised was, which some of you may have, uh, the Neutschwenstein wonder here actually needs a city to be within two tiles of a mountain that is inside your territory. Now, I don't have a city that's uh, next to a mountain or within two tiles. So I need another city, basically, unless I'm going to take one. But if I war on the Moroccans, they don't have a mountain within two tiles either. So what? There are two. Well, there are some mountains down here. I could put a city down here, but it's not particularly good terrain. I think I use a citadel to get that oil later. But there is a spot here. Uh, I think I can put a city there actually. Uh, it's three tiles away from all of. Uh, these city-states around here. And if I buy up that mountain, it will be within two tiles. And I can use the faith I'm getting to buy a great engineer in that city once it turns to Judaism. And then build the Neutschwenstein, if I'm correct. And all those things go to plan. Uh, but so, well, guess I guess I'll see if that works or not in a bit. Uh, my happiness is a bit low, so I probably might have to get build some happiness uh, buildings relatively soon. Uh, but apart from that, no, oh, in between the videos, I also uh, adjusted some of the population as well in certain cities. Uh, nothing really to write home about. I think I'm going to create a Swedish artifact here. Uh, okay. That's Renaissance era. Uh, where do I want to put that then? I put in Helsinki. Is there a way for me to get a bonus? Uh, okay, I'm going to take a second to figure this out. Okay, I've actually uh, figured out that I can get a bonus then. So I've got Cape Town and Assyria artifact, and they're both, both uh, medieval era. Okay, uh, right, so next turn. Something I've also noticed as well. I noticed earlier there was an antiquity site down here that I can't get to. Well, it turns out there's another one. So that's a really gross. Uh, right, so... Guangzhou has been taken by Syria. And I wouldn't be surprised if they're going to take Shanghai as well. Unless the Chinese are down there. But whether or not the Chinese have a big enough military to do that, I don't know. Probably behind Syria on tech as well. Right, uh, Helsinki is starving. Right, let's get a settler out over here then. One, two, three. I'm pretty sure this can be settled on. It's not a very good uh, defensive site. But to be honest, as long as these two are on my side, then I won't have to fear from the Shoshone. These mountains would be very hard for them to get through anyway. Right, so we've got a couple of new archaeologists this turn, I think. Uh, one in Sigtuna and Burka. Uh, there's a Moroccan archaeologist down there, but I doubt it can do anything. This one, I'm going to send out over here. And this one can... Uh, Grab this site. I'm not going to have time to stick a worker up here to get rid of that jungle. Uh, so I'll just 
take long to do it basically. Right, this can lump out. It's gonna help out making some railroads. Uh as can this one, right, how far can it travel? Position can go there. Right up there. A cargo ship, this is going to Colombo. Uh, you can go back to sleep. Production wise, Amsterdam completes the aqueduct. I'm going to build Colosseum here. Definitely need the happiness now. Uh, production. Stockholm completes a stock exchange. I think I'm gonna have to make the crystal redenta here. Um, not gonna have enough great engineers. Uh, so yeah, I'll do that. Um, production Sigtuna completes archaeologist. I think I'll make another one. Probably in Burka as well. Not sure how many me how many I need now. Not many more probably. Uh, Sixteen le left in the whole world. Okay. Uh, next turn. I have to buy that mountain as soon as that settler gets there. Uh, if they nab that mountain before I get there, though, I'm going to have to bring this settler all the way down here and settle down there to get Neutrenstein. I definitely think it's worthwhile settling another city to get it, though. Because uh, it'll give us a load of extra happiness for my cities. Probably uh, let some of these cities grow as well, which I wouldn't otherwise have done. Aeronautics was neither an industry nor a science. It was a miracle. It, it will give me uh, one extra local happiness uh, for certain <laughs> cities. I think I'll just put that and avoid growth now here. Uh, settler. Alright, this can chop down that forest. Uh, Oh, it looks like I've, um, whatever tech, the, well, I just got flight, didn't I? So I, they must have, they've already got that, that Pocatello has, and that's the only tech advantage he had on me, uh, which is a pain. Right, so, what do I want to do with this spy, basically? I might, I could stick it in a city-state, um, I think I might stick it in Sophia. I wouldn't mind the extra military units. How much uh, head are they? 259. I think I will stick it there and try and do a coup on the uh, city-state eventually. Uh, okay, so where are you? Move. And it's Sophia, wasn't it? Okay. This worker can come near to the capital to help out. Okay, <laughs> Helsinki starving. Colombo extra influence from the trade route. Right, Rotterdam completes the windmill. Uh, any more production here? Uh, not massively. I think I've maxed out production as much as I can. Uh, I think I'll build public school then. I 
Something I didn't realize as well before, the annex cities have slightly different happiness to the other cities, but I can't find anywhere where it tells you uh, what the calculation is per citizen. I did a calculation based on their population before with a calculator based on these numbers and what their population was. And I think it's roughly about 1.48 or 1.5 and happiness per citizen. So you take away uh, three population uh, for the city size. Each city costs three and happiness. Uh, so I didn't realize that before that annex cities are cause more unhappiness even after you built the courthouse. So that's something you should be considering when you're creating puppets or not, I guess. Um, or leaving puppets in place. Uh, okay, I think that's uh, end of turn now. Stockholm's I'm going to grow pretty much as large as the amount of food it's got can uh, allow it to get, basically. Uh, because it gets half as much happiness because of the tradition uh, social policy. You might as well allow cap tradition capitals to grow as much as you can. So I think if you, even if that city got up to city size about 50, I don't think it would... Uh, I'd probably have enough local happiness for it. Could have, yeah. I don't think it's going to get the size 50 though. If I'm lucky, I might get to 40 or uh, 40 end of the game. Okay, uh, Zanzibar. No extra bonus from gold with them anymore. If he wants faith, that's good because we're going to win that. Mogadishu is happy because he won a tech race. Geneva's. No longer friends, nearly. Uh, Malacca wants a trade route. Dies the Pocatello has ended. Uh, have a look. Tahiyeti. If anyone else needs that. Looks like Shanghai's hitbox may have Dalek. actually gone up then. I think it's still at war though. Uh, yeah, it's still at war. Alright, so dies. Oh, I can't actually trade them. I think I was getting one from a city state. Right, so. Votes. Uh. Right, so we've got, they're going to vote on both, yes, and both of those, and the Shoshone are. We don't know about China. Uh, I've got a feeling she might like both of those as well. And he's voting all his votes against the world's fear. Um, I think, so I'm going to vote most of my votes basically against the world's fear. I think I'm going to put four votes towards that. Just because I don't think uh, they're going to vote against it. And I'm going to stick all my rest of my votes uh, on nay. Uh, okay. Uh, the only way they would vote against international games, I guess, is if they're doing it to spite me, maybe. Uh, cause for some reason they're saying yes, although it's probably not very good for them if, uh, if I were to win that. Well, definitely not, and there's a good chance I will. Uh, right, so commit delegates. Right, chop the jungle. Get there. Uh, this is finished the railroad. Right, this scientist needs to get out of the way. What tech did I get? I got flight as well, didn't I? Doesn't really do anything for me other than allow me to build those. Um, right, so we're up there. Cargo ship is returned. Uh, that was providing foods to Stockholm. I think I'll do that. 
Our golds. Excellent. Uh, 231 we'll get in. A good sleep. Right. Uh, this. I can still get that mountain. Right. So. Found city. Might have to buy. Happiness uh, building. Okay. Just taking this time for some reason. Right. I need 1500 faith before I can. Should I buy up these tiles? One, two, three. I can buy two tiles there. I think I will. Just to stop uh, Wittenberg from maybe getting it. Okay. Uh, food tile. I can have that one. I'll leave that as it is for now. Need to build a railroad up here as well. Right, so what do I want here? Uh, don't massively need monuments. Oh, this is going to stop me building from national wonders now, though, isn't it? Uh, so there's certain things I need to get here. Uh, so I need up to university, up to universities. Uh, I need Colosseum there. I'll actually buy Colosseum in uh, the city. It'll only give me one happiness, but that's all I need anyway. Um, to Colosseum, and I'll build. Start on a shrine. Right, choose production. Absala completes the windmill. Um, I think I'll get the market then. Might could build a zoo here. Gonna need the happiness now, actually. So yeah, I should start to build some happiness buildings. Colosseum's done here. Uh, I build uh, yeah I will build the circus maximus here okay I think that's it for the turn I need to keep an eye on this basically Hopefully Judaism was spread to the city very quickly and I could just buy the engineer straight there. And I should actually check the build list to see if the Nuchvenstein is showing up. I'll do that now. Don't see any reason why it wouldn't. It's actually within two tiles of the mountain. Should be getting I haven't looked at my great person list for a while, but those great artists and uh oh we got great artists there. Should be getting a musician relatively soon as well. Okay, uh I think he's starving still, great artist. World's Fair was not passed and uh, International Games has passed. So the only one who voted against it was China, which I'm not surprised by. Uh, Turku has the religion, brilliant. Uh, it's World's Fair. I need to start building or sticking production into uh, the international games with all my cities basically now then. Uh, change production. Yeah, Neutrofenstein is available to uh, build. I can actually... Even uh, I can use my faith to buy uh, shrines and not shrines. What's it called? Uh, pagodas. I don't think it's showing up there yet, but oh, there it is. 
I can do that in a bit, but I'm gonna I need the great engineer first. Uh okay, so right, I figured out proposal that later. Uh this work is finished building a railroad. New archaeologist there. Going over there. This archaeologist can go there. Right, he can go to sleep. Uh, this I'll probably use this great artist for another golden age once this one's ended. Can go to sleep. Is there anything I'm forgetting about now? Probably. Right, production. I think I'm going to stop making archaeologists in Burka, maybe. Um, well, actually, uh, there's a site there. I should get that first. Uh, right, so Burka, archaeologist. Uh, I think he's growing again. Need some happiness. I think I'll be able to mark it. Uh, make a proposal. Right, I'm going to need a second or two for this. Okay, I've had to look through all of uh, the potential policies that I could pick. And I think uh, I'm actually going to pick uh, the one that I actually voted against last time. It's crazily enough. Uh, basically, this is because the whoever wins it gets a culture bonus for 20 turns. And if I'd have had it last time, if, uh, let, allowed it to go through last time, of course, I wouldn't be putting any production into it, so I wouldn't be able to win it. But this time, I will be. And I do plan on winning it. And that extra culture will be turned into uh, tourism and social policies, which will help out. Uh, there are other ones I could pick. Will Digeology to give me extra delegates, but I'm doing fine on that, I think, anyway. And there's one which uh, gives uh, culture for natural, for, for wonders, uh, wonder buildings. I could um, pick that, maybe. I think I've got the joint most wonders, uh, but I don't think it will be that as good as, say, winning the World's Fair. So uh, I'm going to pick that. I have no idea what the AI will pick now. I guess we'll find out in a turn or two. Uh, so, World's Fair, commit proposal. And there's something else I've completely forgotten about, which is very important. After having uh, one gotten my vote through, I haven't uh, switched my cities to start building it. So, I need to do that. So, all of these are. Now need to start international games. That's not allowing me to move it up for some reason. Right, good. Right, so I think I'll pretty much all of my cities will now. Uh, I let that complete. The archaeologist, I think. Uh, that's got no production, so I let that complete it. Uh, international games. Yeah, it's still not allowing me to move that up. Right, uh... Okay. I'm gonna finish that zoo first, because my happiness is dreadful. Uh, international games here. And here. Oops, wrong one. and here okay and I think that's it for the turn uh, okay right next turn I have to start building walls in my cities as well if I'm going to get Walls and castles, uh, if I get Nuchenstein, um two, three turns away from that, getting a great engineer.
Helsinki's production lines very close to finishing so I'm gonna start building barracks and uh, maybe even an odd unit which I haven't done for an extremely long time. I think the only way I could take Morocco out quicker than uh, really quick now is by getting nukes so that may become I may think about doing that. Uh, right, Turkey's gone up in population. Uh, deal with provided silk to Pocatello is ended. Right. What's this is looking like? We've com contributed 410 and it's 9% done. Uh, not sure there's any way of getting extra details here on that. Right. Uh, right, so there's archaeologist here. Uh, right, I guess I'll send him up here. Right, caravan is returned. I think Wittenberg wants a trade route. It's 109. I'll figure that out in a minute, though. Uh, if he is nearly decayed to the point where they're no longer ally, I want them to stay inside because I need the aluminium. Uh, once that fate will come in, 28 turns, uh, give a gift, I'll give you 500. And Geneva are no longer friends, I'm not going to bother with them though. Right, so railroad is done here. In theory, these should be connected by railroad now. Yeah, modify for railroad connection because they're connected via harbour basically. Uh, right, this unit can come around here. Sleep. Right, just a caravan then. Uh, right, so which cities? Wittenberg needs trade route, but it's on really high up. Uh, I think Vancouver does as well, which is inland. 97. Uh, they're minus 1.75. I think we're, that caravan was trading to Rabat, but I think, uh, yeah, I'm trading to Marrakesh, so. Don't need more than two going there. I think I'll trade caravan to Vancouver then. Uh, I want science actually. I have the lead with that. Actually, I traded to Wittenberg. Right, so establish trade route. Wittenberg 12. I should probably check to see if it's the. which gives us the most money. Wittenberg should be Stockholm now. 11.7. 11.7. Not sure why it's showing two routes to the same city there. Uh, right, Wittenberg. I don't think it's sending faith though, which is a bit of a pain because the. Uh, uh, Shoshone sends missionaries to it all the time. Right, so next turn. Alright, we've got an archaeological dig done. And I'll have a Dutch artifact. I think it's more worthwhile me taking artifacts rather than the landmarks. I don't see how that could end up as more being more tourism than this. Or it is possible, maybe it could be. If it was ancient era, you get more culture. Well, the older the culture, the earlier the era that it's from, you get more culture for landmarks. Uh, right, but I'll go Dutch artifact. And where do I want to stick that? Uh, don't think I have any broadcast 
towers anywhere but the top two cities, so I'll stick it in Amsterdam for the moment. Okay. Alright, next turn. No longer hate. Right. Looks like I forgot about that running out. Seven per turn. No longer hate. Five. No monkey. Four. No monkey. Three. K. Send an archaeologist somewhere, but it's going to be too late. Right, so this 15%, you can see how much it goes up for each of the different civilizations if you keep an eye on it, but I didn't then. Uh, arguably, if I could figure out when I've put in 50% or more, then I should stop uh, putting it in production, but that's going to be hard to do. So I probably won't stop. Uh, won't stop putting in production until I, well, very late or if at all. Right, so great scientist is done. Right, so... Okay. Golden Age is nearly over. This worker can build a railroad up here, I guess. Uh, probably have it along that line. Right, archaeologist. Um, how long is this going to take to chop? Three turns. Right, I'll stick him on that one then. Right, this can go to sleep. Uh, Worker. Bring it back uh, eastwards. Uh, general, I'll put the scientists can go to sleep. I think I got two scientists again. I'm gonna have to build one of them soon. I right, cancel the quest. Whitterberg happy. Okay, I think uh, that's about it for this video. Uh, so thank you for watching. Please like, comment and subscribe and I'll see you next time.